So the next question. Prove that the greatest integer function f from r to r given by f of x equal to greatest integer of x is neither 1, 1 nor 1, 2 where greatest integer of x denotes the greatest integer less than or equal to x. Okay. f of x equal to greatest integer of x is neither 1, 1 nor 1, 2. We have to prove that this is not 1, 1 and not 1, 2. To prove not 1, 1 and not 1, 2 it is enough to take an example and show that it is not the condition is not satisfying. Okay. So here if we need to prove it is not 1, 1. We just take an example and we will show that it is not 1, 1. Same way we will take another example to show that it is not 1, 2. Greatest integer function. Do you know how we have defined the greatest integer function in your plus 1 classes? f of x is equal to greatest integer of x. If I need to find the greatest integer of 2.5. What I do is I will draw the number line. Without drawing the number line also we can find the answer but still 2.5 comes here isn't it and the integers I have already marked in the number line minus 3 minus 1 0 1 2 3 is after 2.5 so till 2.5 you have to take the greatest integer greatest integer among the, all the integers less than 2.5 which, which is that integer 2 so greatest integer value of 2.5 is 2 if I am taking 2.75 2.75 2 also lies between 2 and 3 isn't it so which is the greatest integer less than 2.5 greatest integer which is less than 2.75 that is also 2 Okay, same way if I need to find the greatest integer of 3.9 can you say the greatest integer it is 3 and if I want to find the greatest integer of 0, which is the greatest integer of 0, it is 0 itself. Greatest integer of 3 is 3 itself. Same way, if I need to find the greatest integer of minus 2, minus 2 is here, isn't it? Minus 1, exit, right? Minus 4, it goes on like that. Greatest integer of minus 2 is minus, minus 2 itself. Suppose I need to find the greatest integer of minus 2.5. Where minus 2.5 comes? Minus 2.5 comes in between minus 2 and minus 3. Okay, this is minus 1, minus 2, minus 3. So, minus 2.5 comes in between minus 2 and minus 3. So, which is the greatest integer which is less than minus 2.5? It is not minus 2 because minus 2 is a value greater than minus 2.5. So, greatest integer of minus 2.5 is negative 3. Okay. Suppose I need to find the greatest integer of minus 1.75. So, what do you have to do? We have to check where minus 1.75 lies. Minus 1.75 lies in between minus 1 and minus 2. So, that. So, greatest integer of minus 1.75 will be the integer. The greatest integer less than minus 1.75 which is minus 2. This is how the function is defined. Again, the question is we have to show that it is neither 1, 1 nor 1, 2. Suppose I am taking x1 as 2.5 and x2 as 2.7. What is f of x1? So, x1 and x2 are entirely different. x1 is not equal to x2. Okay. So, what is f of x1? f of x1 is greatest integer of 2.5. What is the value? 2. Same way. What is f of x2? f of x2 is greatest integer of 2.7. And that value is also 2. That means for 2x values we have a common image 2. Hmm? We took only 2. There are many, many, many values which is having the same image 2. That means here f of x1 is equal to f of x2. What was our condition for 1, 1? Our condition was if f of x1 equal to f of x2, then it should imply x1 equal to x2. That was our condition. Now what we do, did is we took x1 not equal to x2. Then we have to get f of x1 not equal to f of x2. But we are getting f of x1 equal to f of x2. Which implies f is not 1, 1. And if I want to show using Venn diagram. Suppose I am taking so many elements are there. So many numbers are there. 2.1, 2.2, 2.3, 2.4 etc. And here. It is from R to R, real numbers to real numbers, F is the set. So here also so many numbers are there. 1, again so many numbers, 2, again so many numbers, 3. All the real numbers are there. 2.2, .2, the image is 2. 2.2, .2, the image is 2. 2.3, the image is 2. 2.4, the image is 2. So there are many elements with the same image. This type of function is called a many one function. That means this function is not a one one. Okay.